Hey, beautiful beauties, wonderful lovelies, a pleasant afternoon to you. Listen to me, beautiful people, please. We must grow and become better people every day. The Bible says, because people do not have vision and a component of vision is a thing called knowledge, the people perish. And it doesn't mean a physical perish, really. It is talking about you perish in terms of your dreams. You perish in terms of your goal. You perish spiritually. You perish financially. You perish socially. And your life is like a complete decay. Purposeless without meaning. And one of that is because of lacking knowledge. Now, not everyone who you see correct people or they're not in support of something means that they have ill motive towards that something or towards those individuals or that person, sorry. So it doesn't mean that they're filled with bad mind or they have malicious envy or malignant jealousy. Not, no, not in all cases. When Solomon was guiding his son, he said, son, Take heed to wise counsel. Wise counsel sometimes feels like somebody, if you have a deep cut and somebody throws a rubbing alcohol on it with salt. But hear what the person is really trying to kill the bad bacteria so that the healing process can begin when you put on the other medicated drugs. Not everyone who comes and gives a correction or says, I'm not in support of that. I don't like that. And they state reasons why. Means that they're coming from a place of bad mind. Everything for people these days is bad mind. Somebody bad mind in them. People have bad mind. Don't tell anybody anything because it's bad mind. Not true. Not true. The Bible says, you know that the Bible says, confess your sins one to another. Confess your weaknesses one to another so that you can pray for each other. There are those who will pray for you and help in your hurdling of the challenge and difficulties. Ten times it says one. You remember what two heads are better than one. Two heads are better than teamwork makes the dream work. People, it's not just a saying. It is a reality. Not everyone is coming from a bad place. Not everyone means somebody bad. Stop labeling everybody as yeah, them red eye, them bad man, them envious and jealous. Not in all cases. Sometimes they want you to soar like an eagle. But you're going down a path that will make you behave like a chicken and fade away. So ask God for the gift of discernment so he can know who is true and who is false. But don't dub everybody as bad man. Guys, follow me on TikTok. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Share this message.